transformations of random variable in this transformation we have random variable x as input input random variable and it is transformed into random variable y where y is transformation of x x is input random variable with pdf f of x y is output random variable with pdf f of y now first case if transformation is monotonic monotonically increasing monotonically increasing means y is tx we have two different values of x x1 and the corresponding y is y1 that is tx1 and for x2 y is y2 that is tx2 transformation is monotonically increasing if x2 is greater than x1 then y2 is also greater than y1 then transformation is monotonically increasing let us take an example of monotonically increasing curve and we have two values x1 and x2 where x2 is greater than x1 and the corresponding y is r y1 and y2 so in this monotonically increasing curve we can see that x2 is greater than x1 and the corresponding y2 is greater than y1 hence this curve is monotonically increasing now this transformation monotonic monotonic transformation is all, always one to one transformation it means for unique value of x we will get unique value of y now we will see how to find the relation of pdf of random variable y from the pdf of random variable x i am drawing the transformation again
for x corresponding this is corresponding y and this one is transformation of x y is transformation of x now we will write this cdf cdf of random variable y and cdf of random variable y is probability that capital y should be less than or equal to small y now from this plot we can see anything below this line will have capital y less than or equal to small y but in this region we will have to satisfy this transformation also it means we cannot go beyond this this line means for capital y less than equal to small y the x should be less than small x means value of x cannot go beyond this value because if we select say x x here make it x1 here so the corresponding y or the corresponding y1 will be greater than small y and it is not the desired probability so we will be limited to this region so in terms of x probability that capital y less than equal to small y is equal to probability that this capital x is less than or equal to small x so cdf of random variable of random variable y is probability that capital x is less than equal to small x we can write this in terms of pdf integration of pdf from minus infinity to x i have explained this in the previous lectures so this is the cdf of random variable y in terms of pdf of random variable x and this is right side is nothing but the cdf of random variable x so if transformation is monotonically increasing then PD, cdf of random variable y is same as the cdf of random variable x now if i differentiate this cdf with respect to y if pdf of random variable y in the right hand side differentiating cdf of random variable x with respect to y left hand side is pdf of random variable y in right hand side we can write this d by dx f of x into dx by dy so pdf of random variable y this differentiation of cdf of random variable x with respect to x is pdf of random variable x into dx by dy 
or we can write this as CDF PDF of random variable x divided by dy by dx. This is PDF of random variable y in terms of transform from random variable x where transformation is monotonically increasing. Now let us see the second case where transformation is monotonically decreasing. If transformation is monotonically decreasing. Monotonic transformation means one to one transformation and uh, this transformation is monotonically decreasing. Okay. So, transformation is y equals to p of x for value x1 corresponding y is y1 that is p x1 and for another value x2 y is y2 that is p x2 if x2 is greater than x1 and y2 is less than y1 then transformation is monotonically decreasing let us draw y versus x where transformation is monotonically decreasing selecting two values of x that is x1 and x2 corresponding values of y are y1 that is tx1 and y2 that is tx2 now we can say we can see x2 is greater than x1 and x2 is greater than x1 and this y2 is less it means transformation is monotonically decreasing now we will find out the pdf of random variable y from the pdf of random variable i will draw the transformation again monotonically decreasing transformation selecting x and the corresponding y. Now we will write the CDF of CDF of random variable y and CDF of random variable y is f of y that is probability that capital Y should be less than equal to small y. anything below this horizontal line will have capital Y less than equal to small y but we will have to satisfy the transformation also so we will focus on the region where x is greater than small x this region where x is greater than small x you select x here suppose x1 here then the corresponding y see the corresponding y will be 
greater than this small y so that will not satisfy this condition capital y should be less than equal to small y so for capital y less than equal to small y we'll select capital x should be greater than small x because this will satisfy the transformation also so we can write the probability that y is less than equal to small y as probability that x greater than small x or f of y is probability that transformations of capital x is greater than small x and less than equal to infinite so cdf of random variable y is integration of pdf of random variable x from x to infinite now we know that integration of pdf from minus infinity to plus infinity can be written in two parts integration of pdf from minus infinity to x plus x to infinite integration of pdf from minus infinity to plus infinity is always 1 this part is cdf of random variable x plus integration of pdf from x to infinite so integration of pdf of random variable x from x to infinite is 1 minus cdf of random variable x now substituting this relation here so cdf of random variable y is 1 minus cdf of random variable x find the pdf of random variable y will differentiate the cdf of random variable x with respect to sorry we will differentiate cdf of random variable y with respect to y so differentiation of one with respect to y is zero differentiation of cdf of random variable x with respect to y can be written as differentiation of cdf of random variable x with respect to x into dx by dy the differentiation of cdf of random variable y with respect to y is pdf of random variable x differentiation of cdf of random variable x with respect to x is pdf of random variable x into or better to write divide by dy by dx now see if this transformation is monotonically decreasing you can see transformation is monotonically decreasing so dy by D, dx has to be negative this will be negative the slope of monotonically decreasing curve has to be negative so in general this negative and negative will make positive so in general pdf of random variable y is pdf of random variable x divide by magnitude of slope of 
monotonically increasing or decreasing curve this relation will satisfy the monotonically increasing or decreasing curve or we can write write it like this pdf of random variable x into mod of dx by dy now let's see few examples of transformations of continuous random variable where transformation is either monotonically increasing or decreasing first if x is uniformly distributed random variable from minus 1 2 plus 1 and y is another random variable such that y y is 2x plus 1 then find the pdf of a random variable y this is the first question now let us draw the pdf of a random variable x x is uniformly distributed random variable from minus 1 to plus 1 height has to be 1 by 2 because area under the curve of pdf is unity now we can see this transformation is 2x plus 1 it is equation of straight line with slope positive slope 2 and intercept on vertical axis is 1 so this transformation is monotonically increasing so we can write pdf of random variable y as pdf of random variable x divided by dy by dx slope of transformation magnitude of slope of transformation and differentiation of y with respect to x is 2 so this pdf of random variable y is pdf of random variable x divided by 2 so 1 by 2 into pdf of random variable x that is 1 by 2 from for x minus 1 to plus 1 and 0 otherwise now see this pdf of random variable y is written in terms of x we will write this pdf in terms of y so f of y is now 1 by 4 see if x is if x is minus 1 then corresponding y should be minus 2 plus 1 that is minus 1 and when x is plus 1 then y is 2 plus 1 that is 3 and zero otherwise so this is the pdf of a random variable y now we can see that this transformation is linear so input random variable x is uniformly distributed hence the output random variable y is also uniformly distributed from minus 1 to plus 3 let's see the next example where x is a random variable with gaussian pdf and mean value of random variable x is 2 variance of random variable x is 4 now y is 
another random variable defined as y is minus x plus 3. Now find the PDF of random variable y. First, let us write the PDF of random variable x that is 1 upon 2 pi sigma x square root over e to the power minus x minus mx square divided by 2 sigma x square. So the PDF of a random variable x is now sigma x square is 4 so it is 1 by square root of 8 pi e to the power minus x minus 2 whole square divided by 8. This is the PDF of random variable x. Now the transformation is y is minus x plus 3. It is equation of straight line with uh, negative slope and intercept is uh, plus 3 on vertical axis. So this uh, transformation is monotonically decreasing. Hence the PDF of random variable x, sorry y is PDF of random variable x divided by divide by mod of the slope of transformation and the slope of transformation is minus 1 so mod is mod is 1 it means pdf of random variable y is equal to pdf of random variable x now we have to write this PDF in terms of y. So now we will replace this x from replacing x y is minus x plus 3. So x is 3 minus y. So now PDF of random variable y is 1 by square root of 8 pi e to the power uh, minus x is replaced by 3 minus y minus y minus 2 square divided by 8. So the PDF of random variable y is 1 by square root of 8 pi. 3 minus 2 is 1. So 1 minus y can also be written as e to the power minus y minus 1 square divided by 8. So this is the PDF of random variable y and the random variable y has same variance but its mean value is now 1. That's how we obtain the PDF of a random variable y where transformation is monotonically decreasing. Non monotonic trans transformation of transformations of a random variable. I will show you one transformation which is non monotonic. Y is P of X, sorry. x is input random variable, y is output random variable. Now, suppose
we have to write the probability that capital Y is less than or equal to small y, where small y is somewhere here. We have to focus on this region where capital Y is less than or equal to small y. At the same time, this, this has, has to satisfy this transformation, this curve. So, this horizontal line is intersecting the transformation at these three points. Suppose x1, x2 and x3. So, for y, capital Y should be less than or equal to small y, the x should be less than x1, x should be less than x1. And x should be between x1 and x2. Then only we we have we can have y greater than sorry y less than small y. If I take x greater than x3, suppose somewhere here, then the corresponding value of y, suppose this is x4, corresponding value of y, y4 is greater than this uh, small y, which is not the desired region. So for y less than equal to small y, x should be less than x1 and x should be in between x2 and x3. So this probability can be written as capital X should be less than or equal to x1 plus probability that capital X is greater than x2 less than equal to x3. So in this case, the PDF of random variable y, I am writing it directly and I will show you with example that how this expression can be derived. The PDF of random variable y is summation of PDF of random variable x at xn divided by mod of transformation at x equals to xn. For this particular case, f of y is CDF of random variable x at x1 divided by magnitude of transformation at x equals to x1 plus CDF of a random variable x at x2 divided by magnitude of transformation sorry magnitude of slope of transformation at x2 plus pdf of random variable x at x3 divided by magnitude of slope of transformation at x3. This is the general form of uh, PDF of a random variable y in terms of PDF of random variable x where the transformation is non-monotonic. Now let's see one example through which I can explain this uh, relationship. 
input random variable is x with pdf f of x and the transformation is y equals to k x square y is output random variable with pdf f of y Now see y versus x curve is better to write capital X square. This curve is something like this. Now let us select a value of a random variable y. Now we have to write the CDF of random variable y. That is probability that y less than equal to small y. Now for this y we have Two x here x is positive here x is negative and this x is uh, square root of uh, y by k and this is minus square root of y by k Now we have to find the value of x such that capital Y is less than equal to small y in this region of x should also satisfy this transformation. So the x should be in this region. x should be between minus x and 0 and x should be between capital X should be between 0 and x because if I select x here capital X greater than small x suppose x is x1 here the corresponding y1 will be greater than small y so capital X cannot be greater than this is small x Similarly, if I select x here, x2, where capital X is less than small x, the corresponding value of y, that is y2, this y2 is greater than y, it means the capital X cannot be smaller than minus x and capital X cannot be greater than plus x. So x, capital X should be in between minus x and plus x. So this probability is probability that capital X is greater than minus x and less than equal to small x. Now see if, if the CDF of random variable x is known then we can write this probability in terms of CDF of random variable x that is CDF of x CDF of random variable x at x minus CDF of random variable x at minus x because because probability that x greater than x1 less than equal to x2 is CDF of random variable x at x2 minus CDF of random variable x at, at x1. We have used this relation. So CDF of random variable y is f of x minus f of minus x. Now to get the PDF will differentiate CDF with respect to 
y cdf of random variable y differentiating cdf of random variable y with respect to y this will be differentiation of cdf of random variable x with respect to x into differentiation of x with respect to y minus differentiation of cdf of random variable x with respect to x or differentiation of f of minus x with respect to x into differentiation of minus x with respect to y so in the left hand side we have pdf of random variable y and uh, this differentiation is differentiation of pdf of random variable x with respect to x is cdf of random variable x with respect to x is pdf of random variable x dx by dy and uh, this minus minus will be plus and this differentiation of f of minus x is small f of minus x dx by dy we can write this pdf as f of x plus f of minus x divided by dy by dx now the the transformation is y equals to k x square so dy by dx is 2k x hence the pdf of random variable y is f of in place of x we will write square root of y by k plus f of minus square root of y by k divided by 2k x where x is square root of if x is uniformly distributed random variable from minus 1 sorry from uh, minus pi to plus pi and y is defined as y equals to cos x then find the pdf of a random variable y first of all let's draw the pdf of A random variable x, which is uniformly distributed from minus pi to plus pi, so its height has to be one by two pi. Now let us draw the transformation. Transformation is better to write capital X here. Transformation is. cos x y is cos x from minus pi to plus pi so it is monotonically decreasing for positive values of x and it is monotonically increasing for negative values of x x is minus pi to plus pi 
now let us select a value of y this is y and the corresponding x these two this is minus x here we have plus x so cdf of random variable y is probability that y should be less than equal to small y so to satisfy this probability x should be either less than minus x or greater than plus x then only y is less than equal to capital y is less than equal to small y and this will satisfy the transformation also so this is the probability that uh, x capital x is less than equal to minus x plus probability that capital x is greater than small x probability that capital x is less than equal to small x is cdf of random variable x at minus x and the probability that capital x is greater than small x is 1 minus cdf of random variable x now to get the pdf of random variable y we will differentiate this cdf with respect to y differentiation of cdf of random variable sorry yes differentiation of cdf of random variable x with respect to x and then differentiation of minus x with respect to y plus differentiation of 1 with respect to y is 0 then we have minus minus differentiation of cdf of random variable x with respect to x and uh, dx by this will be CDF, pdf of random variable uh, f of minus x with negative sign because of this minus sign dx by dy minus pdf of x dx by dy so the pdf of random variable y is uh, minus of fx plus f of minus x divided by dy by dx now transformation is y is cos x so dy by dx is minus sin x so we can write f of y CDF, pdf of random variable y as um, see this f of x is even function so f of minus x is again f of x because of the given pdf of random variable x is even function so this will be twice of f of x divided by this dy by dx this negative sign will be there 
this negative sign will be there. So divide by dy by dx is minus sin x. So the PDF of y is 2 by sin x into f of x. Write this PDF in terms of y. So 2 sin x is cos inverse y. f of x is 1 upon 2 pi where x is changing from minus pi to plus pi and 0 otherwise. So f of y is 1 upon pi sin cos inverse y x 0 at x 0 the maximum value of y is plus 1 and at x plus pi or minus pi y is minus 1 so x is changing from minus pi to plus pi and y is changing from minus 1 to has to be minus 1 to plus 1 and pdf is 0 otherwise Now one last, last example, where, uh, sorry, one Now one last example, if x is uniformly distributed random variable from minus 1 to plus 1 and y is x square then find the pdf of find the pdf of a random variable y This is the PDF of a random variable x which is uniformly distributed from minus 1 to plus 1. So height is 1 by 2 and this transformation is parabolic which is monotonically increasing, decreasing and increasing both. Here x is limited by minus 1 to plus 1. Now if I select y, small y, then x should be in between minus x and plus x. So CDF of random variable y is probability that y is less than equal to small y. This probability is is uh, probability that x is greater than minus x and less than equal to plus x. So in terms of CDF it is f of x minus CDF of x at minus x. Now to get the PDF, differentiate the 
CDF of y with respect to y. So this is d by dx, f of x, dx by dy minus d by dx, f of minus x into d of minus x dy. So left hand side is PDF of random variable y. This is PDF of random variable x into dx by dy. And this minus minus will make, make plus f of minus x into dx by dy. We can see this this PDF is even function. So f of minus x is f of plus x. So this is f of x into 2 dx by dy or pdf of random variable x twice of pdf of random variable x divided by dy by dx. Write this pdf of random variable y as twice of twice divided by dy by dx that is 2x f of x or pdf of random variable y is f of x by x and x is uniformly distributed so it is 1 by 2 from minus 1 to plus 1 and 0 otherwise now this pdf is written in terms of pdf of y written in terms of x so we will re replace x by y so f of y is 1 by 2 in place of x we will write square root of y limits for y we will identify from the transformation curve that lower limit of y is 0 and upper limit of y is 1 so y should vary from 0 to 1 and it is 0 otherwise this is the pdf of a random variable y so this is how we will find the transformation of continuous random variable where transformation is uh, monotonically increasing monotonically decreasing or transformation is non-monotonic